Amancio Ortega opened his first clothing store in Spain in 1975. There wasn't anything original about the store. All he did was sell look-alike products of popular high-end brands in what he liked to call instant fashions. The store was a massive success. Ortega's secret was he didn't try to predict the future trends like the rest of the industry. Instead, he focused on delivering products to his customers at the right time, price and location. Ortega kept his focus and over the next 40 years, he executed a pioneering distribution strategy that would catapult his store called Zara to be the world's largest fashion company. Good evening, everyone. My name is Simon Knapp. I am co-founder and CEO of Pixmoto and I became a part of Ortega's story when I led a team to open up a Zara store in the Middle East and I got to see firsthand what happens when a company executes a distribution strategy. And just like Ortega did with Zara, we are driving Pixmoto into one of the fastest growing industries in the online world today. Retailers are spending hundreds of millions of dollars producing digital video as a way to promote and sell products online. They've got a major problem. Retailers are struggling to get a return on their digital investment because it's extremely difficult for you to purchase any products while you're watching the video. Without an effective call to action, here's what your online buying experience looks like. You pause on the product, you type in the name of the brand, you scroll through hundreds of products trying to find the one you are looking for. And by that time, the moment of inspiration has passed you by. Pixmoto solves this problem. Pixmoto is an online shoppable video platform that displays the product at the exact time they appear inside the video so you can easily click on the products that you like. And when you do, you are taken to the product inside the online store and the products are effectively put into your hands so you can immediately buy them online. How cool is that? <laughs> well, we tested our cool idea with a group of online retailers and the results we got, they even surprised us. One in three people clicked on at least one product while they were watching the first Pixmoto experiences. When we first shared these results with our team of mentors, hmm, it's fair to say they're a little skeptical. I'm gonna let you into another little secret. I'm not gonna tell you who, but some of them thought it was bullshit. <laughs> it's lucky us Aussies have got thick skins. <laughs> and we're a determined bunch. So we sat down with them and over a couple of Cole Fosters, that's Australian, the beer, <laughs> we showed them all the data we'd collected about every single person that had watched the first Pixmoto experiences, where they were, what devices they were on, and of course the total products they'd clicked on. And after showing them the results, our mentors knew the power of Pixmoto. Pixmoto is not alone on the online shoppable video market, and there are a number of other people who are trying to tackle the same problem that we are. There's one major difference. They don't know Ortega's secret like we do and understand that the real winners of any industries are the ones that master the art of distribution. So while our competitors have been spending millions of dollars of investors' money on just producing products with fancy features, our focus has been on executing a distribution strategy so that Pixmoto can be experienced by customers in thousands of different digital locations. Our distribution strategy is built on three core foundations. Almost half of all online transactions today now occur on a mobile device. Pixmoto works on all devices, 
but is the only solution that seamlessly works on all mobile platforms. 20% of all online transactions today now come directly through affiliate marketing channels. And I've got some exciting news to share with you. We have signed a strategic partnership with one of the world's largest affiliate marketing companies. And we successfully kicked off our beta program with them last month. We are working hand in hand with the Rackman team and already online retailers are lining up to pilot Pixmodo to their affiliates and global publishers through the Rackman network. It's the third foundation that gets us really excited and keeps us all motivated. That by the end of today, over 225,000 product review videos will have been created and posted online in a phenomenon known as social vlogging. YouTube channel offering hair and makeup tutorials. Goes by the name so well. The winner for best British vlogger is so At this exact moment, we are exploring commercial partnerships with the agencies that manage the business affairs of some of the world's largest vloggers, so that for the first time, online retailers can commercially access these product review videos to generate millions of dollars of new online sales using Pixmodo. So what's the team you think that we would need to execute our distribution strategy? Well, let me introduce you to them. Peter loves all things sight and sound, and he's been pioneering ways to distribute digital video since it was the size of a postage stamp. Rick, he saw his first ever computer at a father and son day at NASA, and he immediately knew that he wanted to become an expert in everything zeros and ones, and he is one of the best. Jack filmed his first ever video at the age of eight using his brother's beta cam. Yes, a beta cam. And he has been mastering the art of branding and storytelling ever since. And me, well, there are two things that get me really excited in business, data and retail. And I've been mastering the ways to sell products to you both in store and online. And our team is so confident that Pixmoto is going to help online retailers generate new sales, there is no upfront costs to use our solution. Our revenue model is based purely on performance. So when our affiliates and retail partners make more money using Pixmoto, so do we. Look, I'm not going to try and convince you that the online retail, affiliate marketing, and social vlogging markets are going to be huge because the fact is, they already are. What I am going to say to you is, the real winner of the shoppable video market isn't going to be the ones producing products with fancy features. It's going to be the one focusing on delivering a shoppable video solution to their customers at the right time, the right place, and the right location. And we are confident that we are well on our way to achieving this ambition. Thank you, everyone.